Hello everybody. So today I want to show you how to answer. I will put about B equals to this one and Q equals to this one. So we have the S. That means we need to do first the derivative of B with respect to Y. So we have like this. So this one we have number one. This one we have S E to the power of S Y and we multiply by y because if we do first the derivative of this one we keep the same e to the power of sy later that we need to do first the derivative of sy you got about s now we go to the second one we have dy that means we need to do first the derivative of q with respect to s so this one you got number zero because we don't have s now for the second one so this one we have number one this one we have y e to the power of s y later that we put about s and we can see that they are the same. So that is about exact. So I need to set up about the function fsy equals to the integration. So I select this one. So the integration of e to the power of sy that is about y e to the power of s y over y so we can simplify and you got e to the power of s y next we need to do first the derivative of f for the both side with respect to y so this one we have s e to the power of sy and this one equals to this one now we simplify for the both side and you got about 2y later that we put the integration for the both sides So this one we got y square and I will put about c. So we return back to this one. The integration of this one that is about gsy. gsy equals to this one and that is about y square. And we know that this one equals to fsy fsy equals to C and we can simplify like this now we have the conditions that means when S equals to number 0 Y equals to number 1 so we put number 1 go in here and here number zero go in here so this one we have number two so we put number two go in here this is the end thank you for watching